Hello and welcome to the In Focus series section of Drishti IAS. I am Aisha Singh and in today's video we will be discussing about the event which is presently going on and that is the Kashi Tamil Sangamam 2023 and as the name itself is saying that it is about coming together of two different entities and forming a Sangam. Sangam means when two different entities comes together then they form a Sangam. So, Kashi. Kashi is, as we all know, Varanasi. Tamil is Tamil Nadu. Sangamam is that both Kashi and Tamil Nadu coming together and forming an entity and happening in the year 2023. So, first of all, about the points of discussion. News, Kashi Tamil Sangamam. Kashi Tamil Sangamam significance. Why is it important? Why was it formed? Then prelims MCQ, this topic you can actually say that it belongs to the topic of culture that is GS paper 1. For, from cultural perspective this is important. The news talks about Prime Minister of India Narendra Modi inaugurates Kashi Tamil Sangamam 2023. What is the ancient connect between Kashi and the Tamil? Ancient connect and Prime Minister Narendra Modi has recently inaugurated it. Now let's see. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on 17th of December has inaugurated the Kashi Tamil Sangamam at Namo Ghat Varanasi. Kashi Tamil Sangamam. So this in many a times in PCS papers also this is asked that where is where was the Kashi Tamil Sangamam 2023 took place. So, you need to remember Varanasi and this first held last year. So, the Kashi Tamil Sangamam started in the year 2022 when the first edition took place while in the year 2023 that is recent. This is the second edition which is recently taking place and it is a 15 day event and the nodal agency for the event is Ministry of education this is an important point you need to know about the nodal agency that which is that ministry which is responsible for the happening of the event and it seeks to celebrate north and south india's historical and civilizational connect and the two and the aspect which is connecting both is lord shiva Kashi Tamil Sangamam. As we discussed, 2023 is happening in Varanasi, 15-day event, nodal agencies, Ministry of Education. So, around 1,400 dignitaries from Tamil Nadu and Puducherry will visit Varanasi for the 15-day long event. And they will be participating in a number of cultural exchange and exhibitions showcasing art, music, handloom, handicrafts, and different type of cuisines etc of both Varanasi and Tamil Nadu and the cultural exchange means from by the different modes and different ways the cultural exchange of both Tamil Nadu and of Varanasi should take place then batch of the Tamil delegation Teachers, professionals, spiritual leaders, farmers and artisans, writers, traders, businessmen are scheduled to arrive in Varanasi. So, in the, in the 15 days and in the coming days, all the dignitaries from different fields and different perspectives, they will be representing both the sides and the cultural sangamam and the cultural exchange between Varanasi and Tamil Nadu will take place. In the year 2022, around 2400 people from Tamil Nadu were taken to Varanasi in groups and this time around 1400 people will be doing the same thing. Now about the Kashi Tamil Sangamam significance. So what is the significance for holding the Kashi Tamil Sangamam? It is for the historical and civilizational connection between India's north and south. Historical and civilizational connect between north and south and it has a lot to do with the Lord Shiva and its Jyotirlingas especially the Kashi Vishwanath temple of Varanasi. So there are many stories regarding 
the setting up of the shivakashi temple in tamil nadu we will not be going into the stories because there are many many very interesting interesting stories which are there but you just need to know that the north and the south they share a historical and civilizational connection and that historical cultural civilizational connect to to recreate that connect the kashi tamil sangamam has been held and to bring the two knowledge and cultural traditions of the north and south closer as we always talk about that the north india and the south india there is a divide which is going on and there the divide is widening so just to break that perception also and also the things which are not on papers but are going around just not going by those things so to bring together the north and the south and to bring together the culture the kashi tamil sangamam will be of great help and will be of great relevance for the both the places and both the states then understanding of our shared heritage and deepen the people to people bond now that when so many people from different respects and from different fields will be coming and meeting each other so the people centric approach will also work and the people bond will also improve and the objective is about rediscovering rediscovering it means again discovering the old things rediscovering and strengthening it means making stronger the relationship rediscovering and strengthening the ancient intellectual cultural spiritual and artisanal connect between the two cultures it means that what in earlier times used to be there that should also be there in nowadays also rediscovering of the things which was there in the past and coming taking it back and also strengthening the present things which is happening now in the end of prelims mcq any people need to tell me the answer in the comment section the nodal agency for kashi tamil sangamam is we have discussed this in the video so ministry of minority affairs ministry of tourism ministry of education or ministry of culture so give me the answer in the comment section and that's all for today thank you so much for watching till we meet next time keep reading and keep writing